Okay. Sorry for the uh, abrupt cut there. It turns out I undervolted my computer um, more than I should have. So it just froze for a while and then I just, you know, just gave it more room to breathe. And here we are with part two. Now, you know that we did the step one, step two, step three, and we're going to run the script now. And I was just about to tell you that you need to go in this address bar and then type CMD. When you type CMD and hit enter, this new window will pop out immediately. What you're going to type here, and that's where this Python program comes in, right? Sorry, programming language comes in. It's going to let us, it's going to let us make use of these files right here, these two babies. So what I want you to do is I want you to type Python space and then I'm going to do D E L and then you're going to hit tab. When you see assembler here, we don't want that. You're going to hit tab again, make sure that's extract and then you're going to do space and then you're going to put hyphen d and then space and then what you're going to do is you're going to type ins i want you to press tab find the file that ends in 1.11.0 make sure that's that now you're you're ready to hit enter when you hit enter it's going to do its magic and it's also creating a folder here okay all right so next what i want you to do next is i want you to just stay here i want you to type again python space del tab tab make sure that's extract space hyphen d space ins tab we already did that 1.11.0 tab now again tab make sure that's 1.9.3 dot exa okay hit enter it's gonna do its magic again another folder here so two folders are created okay now what we're gonna do is we are going to create a new folder here let's say downgrade BIOS the name does not matter but we're gonna basically do what we're gonna basically do is we're gonna go inside 1.11.0 this one this folder we're gonna we're not gonna touch here we're gonna go into entries and then what we're gonna do here we're gonna select this one this one this one and this one okay now this is important make sure you chose the exact same files as me copy those files go up go up go to downgrade bios folder paste go up now we're done with the folder that ends in 1.11.0. We're going to move to 1.9.3. Let's go in there. We're not going to touch here. Let's go in entries. Now, what we're going to do here, we're going to select this one, this one, this one, this one, 
this one and this one. Basically what we're doing is we're not touching the files that we already got from the folder that ends in one point blah blah blah. We're getting all the other files from here. Copy these files, go up, go up, go to downgrade BIOS, right click, paste. Okay, now it looks like this. Check if you have all these files in your downgrade BIOS or whatever you named your file. Folder, sorry. All right, go up. Now we're going to use this uh, terminal here again. What we're going to do next is we are going to type Python space. This time, again, Dell tab. What we want is assembler. Okay, make sure that's assembler space hyphen F space. And then we are going to feed this script, our uh, manually created folder, whose name is down starts with down. If you type down and then hit tab, it's going to fill it for you automatically. Now, when you write this line of code, you hit enter, it's going to do its magic again. This time, what it did is in that downgrade BIOS folder, it created an execution file like this. Okay. Now, when you double click this exa file, it's going to, it's going to pop up this um, window. Okay. Smaller window. I, I'm not, I'm not going to do these steps because I already did those myself, but basically what you're going to do is you're going to click. Okay. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. And then it's going to restart your computer and it's going to downgrade your BIOS. Okay when it does and when you're back to your windows now this is important you're you're going to click okay okay yes 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 you're going to your computer will restart and you're going to come back here when you come back here don't worry about this warning because i clicked cancel it just warns me that my bios will remain unchanged so this is not a warning actually this is just a you know a statement you're going to come back to your windows and the last step step five is do you remember this first okay let me see hmm that's interesting okay let's uh open them up again all right that's great and this one all right so do you remember the first uh bio screen i told you you're gonna restart your computer and as soon as it's lights turn on, you're going to spam F2. Okay. And this screen will come up again. But this time, what I want you to do is do not touch anything here or here. I want you to go to this restore settings uh, button. Okay. And click that a window like this will pop out. And you are going to select factory settings and then click OK and then apply and then exit. OK, when you do that and when you come back. You can. You can change the values here. OK, and also you can. Oh, I uninstalled that. I was going to show you the. Uh, Intel Extreme Utility, but I tested it. It wasn't grayed out. Okay, so congratulations. Hopefully this video helped you and now your computer is back to this old, these old good days where it could breathe and it could just get things done without getting hotter and hotter. All right. So if you have any questions or comments, feel free to send them my way and Happy New Year's. Happy New Year.